Whoops. Yay. It's been a while since we've broken something in this game. Yes. Also, look, it's a bunch of Mario power-ups. Okay. Let's see. Oasis. No, I don't like perfume. Um. And then we hear somebody scream in the back, You can't compete in my gym! <laughs> Screw you, uh, Erica! In, in Heart Gold, um, if I'm remembering right, they made Erica even more of a bitch. If, if I'm remembering right, there's a scene in Pokemon Heart Gold uh, where you can find Erica and Jasmine hanging around. And Erica is disabled about people, whereas Jasmine is like being shy being. Erica is cool. She's totally doing it with an Ampharos. Jasmine may be my favorite gym leader from Golden Grover. Hmm. Oh, okay, Elder. Hmm, nobody's here. Time to loot! Oops! I'll go into people's houses at night and wreck up the place! Nixon's back! And then we steal all their underwear. Oh. Was it a fish or was it a dragon? Hmm. Access to Cafu restricted. So as we denied access to Cafu to provide rigorous protection from enemies. Outsiders may not enter the village. Here is that the village lodgings may be used. Restrictions have also been placed on Mogai who come to do businesses. No exceptions to Mogai are requesting discussions. Oh, you are you're a newsie. Uh, Farewell for reviews for the massage. Paw massage, oh my. Hooked on that unique tingling feeling, you just are showering it with praise. Reservation system's been adopted, Contel, Contel for details. Extra, extra, read all about it! New president claims no pants! <laughs> uh, is it, well, is it, uh, God, I can't remember the guy from Gravity Falls' his name. I was thinking Sias, because he's already a furry. <laughs> uh, Imagine if somebody reckon... gave Sias power. Does Raven have rules for dog people asking for a friend? <laughs> this is a nice apartment. Oh, steal his booze! La 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 now when darkness will stop turning, fa la 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 <laughs> Ashes where their bodies burning, fa la 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 No more warfig has the power, fa la 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 Hand of God has struck the hour, fa la 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 Oh my, we got an aspiring songwriter, an aspiring artist. Discord, is that you? <laughs> Uh, sure. Uh, how about... Fina! Don't 
that light feeling is good. You can't stand my artlessness. What the? I, what? I, I don't know if something broke or Fina's just talking to herself. I think one of them's the drawing. Oh. She's talking to her... Is the painting talking to her? Stop picking your goddamn nose! <laughs> And it's just gonna be a picture of boob. Aw, oh, lick your nose all crinkly! Oh. See, if we weren't- if we weren't doing this as an LP, I would absolutely be having us talk to every NPC multiple times. Yeah. That, like, that was part of the charm of Grandia, too. Mm. Just the sheer amount of dialogue each NPC had and the amount of world building in it. I feel like I saw this in a, in a chapter of Octopath Traveler for some reason. <laughs> oh dear god. Are you awake now? <laughs> Fun fact, my alarm clock used to beep. Now it just clicks. I usually wake up before my alarm goes off and it's very annoying. Yeah, me too. And then I'm trying to get ready and then it still goes off because I forgot to turn it off and it's like, okay, shush you. <laughs> I mean, my alarm's my phone, like... I'll wake up like an hour before my alarm goes off, try to force myself back to sleep, and eventually give up and then just shut off my alarm. That happens to me on the weekends. <laughs> What, I'm not allowed to talk to people? The most pleasant thing in the world. Cuddling with lantern. <laughs> also, that, that sound was adorable. <laughs> <laughs> it was as adorable as that sneeze. Hey! <laughs> oh! Seriously, why is, why is Rat's finger in his nose constantly? Is he digging that hard for gold? So, okay, we got a literal man-child here. He's been like, go play Pokemon. <laughs> okay, that is not a door. Good for you, kid. And then his mother turns to stone and is like, well, goddammit, now what? I'm now just remembering something from Dragon Quest VII, which you now have a copy of, by the way. <laughs> yes. Lantern may have sent me a few of his games uh, during the week. <laughs> okay, there's the hotel again. Yeah, I guess we'll try it again. Not sure where to go, because we looked everywhere. At least I feel okay, like I... we looked everywhere. Talk to the, uh, talk to the innkeeper again. Okay. Yep, no, I don't want to talk to the bird. I'll talk to the giraffe. Apparently our rooms are just right over here. 
Maybe we just need to leave town and move to the next section or try yeah, to. Yeah, that might be our only option, just right, because I think we've talked to literally everyone. Again, I looked away during the dinner conversation, so I'm not sure what the uh -huh. next... Yeah, okay. We're good at video games. And there are two mana eggs in this section. The oh, west and goody. one in the west savannah wilderness and one in the east savannah wilderness. West and east. Okay, we're in the west. So we're in your territory. How it is. That guy, that scorpion just murdered a rock. Dodos? Do we have to prepare for the ice age? Does anybody care about Tid the Flaw? No. Wow. Have you played Luigi? Blaze brightly, oh flame! Well, now I should say that at least one person cares about Sid the Sloth. His really old girlfriend. 100 million degrees, take that! Come back with reinforcements! How about no? I, I really liked the first Ice Age movie. Yeah! Uh the second and third ones didn't need to happen. I can't remember if I saw the third one. I know I've seen the second one. The third one had dinosaurs. Also, Simon Pegg was like a one-eyed weasel in that, and he just went around fighting off against the... One dinosaur who took his eye, who was basically his Moby Dick. His name was Rudy. Simon Pegg needs to eat, too. I like Simon Pegg as Scotty in the Star Trek movies. Granted, those Star Trek movies are deeply flawed, but that's a discussion for another time. Hmm. It threw its baby at us! We just got yoshi I think. I think so. Maybe this bad, is eh? what eventually uh, Yoshi came from. Or Yoshi turns into these. I'd rather think it's the other way around. <laughs> because those things are frightening. And Yoshi is... baby. Yoshi! I went the completely wrong direction. This is like a weirdly open area for this game. Yeah, and it's kind of hard to navigate. Because it's like I, I think I'm going in a direction and then I'm not. Too many burbs! And over here. I see that scorpion hiding in the rocks. Flap bird. Oh god, this is where Flappy Bird came from! Um, so at that at that arcade in Quail Springs Mall, I did see a Flappy Bird arcade game, to which my response was Why? Yeah. One of my coworkers was telling me about a, an arcade in Oklahoma City that sounded pretty good, though. Ooh. Come on back for more. Blaze brightly, oh flame. Burnout! 
I'm surprised he didn't do the uh, lightning because it levels up multiple things. Uh, I thought about All it. All right, we won. These birds are everywhere. Dad actually saw a roadrunner running out of our yard today. Meep meep. Yep. They they're they are actually the thing here. But was there a coyote chasing after him? We didn't see one, but I have definitely heard coyotes around here. Burn to a crisp! Would you really call it burn to a crisp if it's lightning? That's a bad burb. <laughs> Me meanwhile, Rex barely has magic. Take that. <laughs> see, see, like I oh, and then I you like said the only burn flare. <laughs> I like Rat still, you know, like he's kind of the ninja fast roadie character. Mm -hmm. It's a shame he's such a little skip, though. <laughs> It's like, yeah, mechanically you're okay, uh, but I just want to punch you in the face. Constantly. With a dull and rusty nail. In a two by four. And, see, like, like. That's carved like, like a Roland, penis. Rolling from uh, Grandia Two, I also wanted to punch in the face, but I feel like that's much less justifiable. Like, like, in this one, it's like, like, in this, it's like, I want to punch Rav. Yes! It, it, in Grandia 2, it's like, what was Rome's crime? He existed. <laughs> he existed and it annoys me. <laughs> he reminds you of a child that you don't want to remember. Of course it kicks. Hundred million degrees. Take that. I mean, to be fair, can you really do much else when you have no arms? Yo, yeah, she originally had very tiny arms, so it like in, in the first Smash Brothers, he mostly bashed things with his face or kicked. So you're saying he bashed and bashed and bashed and he bashed him with his face? Yes, I am. <laughs> oh, wind twist like a tornado. Or a pretzel. That, that, that is uh, certainly a cell you shouted out there, Pina. Not bad, eh? Also, our, uh, our chonk has yet to actually chonk. Like, Milda has not gotten a chance to punch anything yet. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm, for some reason, a thing from a, one of the Star Wars novels I actually like came to mind. I think I still gotta be here. You said there was an East version, right? Oh. You're not gonna let me go that way yet. Okay. Very well. We'll go to Brinnen. And it's... Gay Pond. Yep. In the next episode! <laughs> so, Woo! when we come back, everybody... We're going to be checking out uh, what this place is about. But until then. Gay Pond. Gay Pond. <laughs>